Are you going to smash uh, Devon tomorrow 6-0? Yes, of course. <laughs> <laughs> what if Devon beats you 6-0? I go uh, in sport. You you quit. <laughs> <laughs> you see, I quit. end my career. You really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and um, Todd Zilla is strong. Mm -hmm. Yes, wrong. Yeah. <laughs> 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 what what technique have Katorati that technique uh, winning uh, Kennedy not not possible. Not possible. Uh, with Hermes, I think fifty uh, fifty mm -hmm. because Hermes. Uh, well, I think Hermes for Kennedy is not com comfortable. What do you think about uh, Silaev and Vitali? You've seen that Silaev beat Vitali. What do you think uh, about this? Big surprise for me. Uh -huh. Very big surprise. So if you don't have good competition for you in one year, two years, you're always winning, you're always winning, will you just stop arm wrestling, go do movies and say, I don't care anymore? Uh, yeah, maybe. I think about uh, yes. You want very much. With the uh, top hatches? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what would be your dream match if you can challenge anybody in the world after Devon? Who would you want to challenge? Dennis Siplankov. Dennis Siplankov. Yes. Okay. And uh, do you think you best shape versus Dennis best shape? Who would win? I hope uh, I will. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, guys. Here we are, uh, like the team of the East, of uh, King of the Table, because here we have the representatives of Georgia, Levan, the Georgian Hawk, Saginashvili, Iraqi, Zerikashvili, and uh, me also like in the Eastern part of Europe, and we will pull with guys from the West tomorrow. And uh, I wanna ask you guys how you feel, how you feel about this event. Do you like it? Yes, he feels very nice and he okay. ready to fight. Okay, that sounds good. So and now, okay. so let's start. So, uh, Lavan, I've noticed that you're a little bit uh, sick, and uh, usually your competition weight is about 185, 190, maybe a little bit more. But now you're a little bit lighter. Uh, are you sick and is this going to be a problem for you? No, my uh, weight uh, with uh, Vitali been 165 with uh, day 117 uh, and now I'm more. Okay. Uh, when I come here I 180, uh, 2 kilos, it is normal. Uh -huh. Okay. I, I seek, but I try <laughs> for recovery. Okay, I understand. Yeah. And uh, Iraq, you are 98 kilo, Marcy Barbosa 111. Is this going to be a problem for you? No, 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 no problem. No problem for you. Okay, perfect. Special with our kids on that He actually uh, four kilos uh, down. Special. Special. Oh, okay. For this fight, yes. So he lost four kilo on purpose. Yeah. Because last match, he not comfortable ah. for table. Mm -hmm. Too okay. much weight. Uh -huh. I understand. For, for him. Mm -hmm. So my next question would be for Levan. So, do you consider yourself the strongest arm wrestler of all time? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, I know you're very humble, but would you say that in the whole time, let's say Denis Siplankov, maybe you have a great Andrei Pushkar, maybe Richard Lopkis in the best shapes, would you also consider yourself the strongest among these people? Uh, in strongest uh, athletes, yes, yes. Uh -huh. But in all time, I think, I don't know. Yes, I have a very nice record, uh, too much. Uh, fights um, and not losing, losing, but uh, I don't know. Uh, it is not my job. My, my job. <laughs> People 
let's yeah. say who are is the best. Yeah, yeah you're uh, very definitely. humble. Alex, do you think he's the strongest of all time? Not the greatest, the greatest is John Berzang, but the strongest. I wanna base my uh, opinion on the statistics that arm wrestling of today is developing and now it's more than previously. So I think it's uh, logical to say that, for example, the champion of today, uh, the, the strongest of today, the strongest of every time before, because uh, you also ask many guys and they share this opinion. So I think it's, uh, yeah, it's a good answer to say that the champion of today is a champion best of all time. Of course, you, I agree with you, like you say that Richard Lapke is on the list, uh, Andre Pushkar on the list, definitely Denis Stepankov on the list, but I put uh, Levan a little bit, at least a little bit higher mm -hmm. on, on this, like, guys. Yeah, okay. So, Levan, you're undefeated since 2017. You never even lost a round. In the future, if Devon don't beat you, if tomorrow you win, who do you think will be the chosen one to defeat you, to take the crown from you? Oh, what athlete? What athlete? Maybe, I don't know, Alex, maybe Vitaly? Uh, in Did this moment, I don't know. I think uh, uh, if I um, wait maybe one year, um, one person is uh -huh. coming up and we will see who is this, because now um, at least uh, <clears throat> very Alex beat uh, uh, Hermes, Hermes beat uh, Gennady, Gennady beat Chafee, Chafee beat yes. um, <laughs> Alex and yeah. who is mix. Uh, I mean, yeah. uh, not on the stakes. Uh, uh -huh. So in the next three to five years, Maybe, who do you think might have the best chance? Mm. If, uh, um, if Alex seriously mm -hmm. training this, uh, that year, if uh, Vitaly uh, and Georgian athletes too, and uh, more people can mm -hmm. uh, actually, more, more, more athletes have mm -hmm. potential to be strongest. Okay. Yes. I ain't a one trick pony, got a whole bag of magic The snare kick hat sample of raps all matching Fashion and style forever getting better at it The seventh letter replay to authentic pen